welcome back to our channel and in today's video we have an exciting topic to discuss we will be diving into the brand new feature of cyber panel called the wordpress manager this feature is designed to make your wordpress management a breeze trust me it's going to be super exciting so stay tuned before we jump right into it let's quickly explore the process of deploying a wordpress server in the past this has been a challenging task with many control panels however with cyber panel we now have our very own wordpress manager you no longer need to go through the hassle of creating a website and then installing wordpress separately everything can be done in one go log into your cyber panel account over to the wordpress section on the left hand side menu click on deploy wordpress and enter the required information and subsequently click on create website and your wordpress site will be created it's that simple once your wordpress site is created go into wordpress and click on list wordpress to land into this page so on this page you will be able to see all your deployed wordpress sites you can visit them by just clicking on visit and it will take you directly to your site besides you can delete your WordPress sites. This tool is truly amazing as it provides all the information and actions you need in one convenient location. Let's take a closer look at each of the features available in the manager. By clicking on WordPress page title, you will be redirected to WordPress manager. Starting with the general tab, you will find a button labeled open. This button allows you to access your website with just one click, eliminating the need to manually enter the URL. Additionally, the file manager feature grants you direct access to the root files of your WordPress site without the need for additional plugins or tools. Another useful feature is the login button, which automatically logs you into your WordPress dashboard if you happen to forget your password. It's a real lifesaver. Moving on, we have the Git Manager feature. This is particularly helpful for those working with a development team as it facilitates the exchange of information. These four buttons in the general tab cover the essential functions you may need for your WordPress site. It shows you your WordPress version, PHP version of your site. Next is your LS cache. With Cyber Panel, you get LS cache by default. And you can always disable ls cache by simply clicking on this button but it is such a versatile plugin therefore it is so beneficial for your website that it is always better to enable this another important feature you have is of password protection so for example if you have multiple sites and some of those multiple sites has some crucial information and you want it to be password protected this is the button for you Simply click on that and enter your username, enter your password and your site is going to be password protected. Next is the debugging. If you want to debug your WordPress site, just click on that. Next is your search engine indexing. So this is a good feature for improving your SEO. Adjacent to that is the maintenance mode. So for instance, if you want to work, maintain or repair on your WordPress site, you can simply click on that and your WordPress site will automatically convert it into the maintenance mode. In the same way, you can disable your WP Crone. Just simply click on this button and your WP Crone will be automatically disabled by clicking on it. Now, let's explore some of the other tabs available in the WordPress manager. In the plugin tab, you can view a list of all the installed plugins along with their activation status. You can activate or deactivate plugins with a simple click, ensuring seamless management. Similarly, the Themes tab allows you to activate, update or delete themes without navigating through your WordPress dashboard. Everything is conveniently accessible within the WordPress manager. Next up is the Staging tab, which is a super cool feature for web developers. Here you can create a staging site where you can safely test new plugins, themes or features without affecting your live site. This helps you avoid any unwanted glitches or issues. Now let's talk about the backup tab. This is a crucial feature as it allows you to create backups directly from the WordPress manager. You no longer need to manually copy files or databases. With a few clicks, you can create backups for your entire website specific files or databases. If you ever need to restore a backup, you can easily do so from the same tab. 
managing and deleting backups is also a breeze. Last but not least, we have the database tab. Here you will find information about your database name, username and table prefix. Clicking on the database name will automatically redirect you to the PHP My Admin page where you can perform various actions on your database tables such as restoration, repair or optimization. Accessing and managing your database has never been easier. Additionally, you will find three buttons below the database tab. The Manage Application button takes you to the Application Management page which provides additional options to explore. The Auto Update Configuration button simplifies the process of updating WordPress configurations, saving you time and effort. Lastly, the Security button ensures the integrity of your WordPress installation by verifying against checksums. If any errors are detected, you can easily reinstall the WordPress core files to resolve them. That concludes our tour of the WordPress manager in CyberPanel. We hope you found this video informative and exciting. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more CyberPanel content. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for our next video.